my subscribers and welcome back. I hope you enjoyed yesterday's lesson. And if you're new to my channel, please press subscribe so you too can enjoy the lessons and learn English from my channel as well. Today we are going to do the Simple Present Questions Part 2. Uh, make sure you bring something to write with uh, and some paper, a notebook, or something, anything else to write on. All right, we'll see you in a few. Okay, let's review our questions before we get into our exercises that I promised from our last um, video. Do I work? Does he work? Does she work? Does it work? Do we work? Do you work? Do they work? Okay, let's use the, the verb live. Do I live? Does he live? Does she live? Does it live? Do we live? Do you live? Do they live? Let's use do. Do I do? Does he do? Does she do? Does it do? Do we do? Do you do? Do they do? And our last verb to have. Do I have? Does he have? Does she have? Does it have? Do we have? Do you have? have? Do they have? At this point, pause the video, write everything down, and read it to yourself. Okay, here write questions with do or does. I will read the following for you. I like candy. How about you? I play golf. How about you? You live near here. How about Emily? Pause it for a moment and write everything down and when you get back we'll do it together. Okay, great. I like candy. How about you? So you can write. Do you like candy. I play golf. How about you is do you play golf? You live near here. How about Emily? So you, you will use here, does Emily live near here? Okay, I'll read everything over one more time. I like candy. How about you? Do you like candy? I play golf. How about you? Do you play golf? You live near here. How about Emily? Does Emily live near here? Pause the video, write everything down, and read it to yourself. Okay, everybody. Here's some more examples of write questions with do or does. Let me read everything for you first. Jack plays basketball. How about his friend? You speak French. How about your sister? I do yoga every morning. 
How about you? Pause the video here, write everything down, and when you come back, we'll do the questions and answers together. Okay, so, Jack plays basketball, how about his friend? So, we'll put use does here, so we'll say, does Jack's friend play basketball. Okay, does Jack's friend play basketball? Make a nicer K. Okay? All right, you speak French. How about your sister? So you can say. Does your sister speak French? Let's make that a nicer capital F. So, does your sister speak French? And then, I do yoga every morning. How about you? You can use... Do you do yoga every morning? Okay, let me read everything one more time. Jack plays basketball. How about his friend? Does Jack's friend play basketball? You speak French. How about your sister? Does your sister speak French? I do yoga every morning. How about you? Do you do yoga every morning? Pause here, write everything down, and read it to yourself. Again, we're going to use do or does to make questions with these words. Let me read everything for you. Where live your parents? You early always get up. How often TV you watch? Pause the video here and write everything down and read it to yourself and when you come back, we will make full, complete sentences using do or does. Okay. So, where live your parents? It's going to be where do your parents live. Comes where do your parents live? So you early always get up. So again, we're going to use do you always get up early. Do you always get up early? And how often TV you watch? Will be how often do you watch TV? All right, so we just made three questions. Let me go through them again. Where do your parents live? Do you always get up early? How often do you watch TV? Pause the video here and write everything down. Read it to yourself and I'll see you in a moment with more examples. All right, more questions to make with do or does. Let me read all the words for you. You want what 
for dinner. Like you basketball. Your sister like baseball. Pause the video, write everything down, and we'll make sentences when you come back. Okay. You want what for dinner? So it's what do you want for dinner? So it's, what do you want for dinner? Like you, basketball is, do you like Do you like basketball? And your sister like baseball. Is? Does your sister like baseball? Does your sister, does your sister like baseball? Let me read everything one more time for you. What do you want for dinner? Do you like basketball? Does your sister like baseball? Pause the video, write everything down, and read it to yourself, and I'll see you in a moment. More fun question making! All right, we're gonna use do or does. Let me read these for you. What you do in your free time? Your sister live here. Dinner always you have. Pause the video, write the words down, and when you come back, we will make questions together. Okay, great. What you do in your free time. So, turns into what do you do in your free time? time. Turns into what do you do in your free time? Your sister live here. We're going to use does. Does your sister live here? Does your sister live here? Dinner always you have. Do do you always have, oops, let's make a nicer D. So do you always have dinner? Let me read these for you one more time. What do you do in your free time? Does your sister live here? Do you always have dinner? Pause the video, write everything down, and read it to yourself. Okay, <laughs> before we end our lesson for today, let's do these last words together of do or does, and let's make wonderful questions with them. Let me read them for you. What mean this word? In the winter, snow it here. Go usually to bed what time you. Pause the video, write everything down, and when you come back, we'll make the questions together. Okay, great. What mean this word? So, we're going to use what does this word mean? What does this word mean? In the winter, snow it here. Does it snow in the winter here? Does it snow in the winter here? Go usually to bed, what time? You, so we're going to go. 
what time do you usually go to bed? So what time do you usually go to bed? Let me read these one more time. What does this word mean? Does it snow in the winter here? What time do you usually go to bed? Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our video for today. Please press like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed everything that we've learned today and in the past videos. If you're new, welcome again. Please spread the word about my channel. I would really appreciate it. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I will do my best to answer them and get you the best answer I possibly can find. Thank you and happy learning.